Hi everyone, Sat here. So I wanted to give you a quick announcement about Google AR Core. They've made it official now. It's no longer in beta. So you can download the, the, the newest one, the latest one, from the downloads page on the developers.google site. And you can see it here. It's now version 1.0. No preview there in in the wording there, so you, that's pretty cool. That also means that it can do some new interesting things. So not only can it track the floor, but it, it now tracks any flat surface. So you can see that they're tracking the ceiling here, or the ceiling of this this kind of cupboard. And even it looks like in this picture, it's been tracking the walls. As you can see, they they've placed stuff on the walls. I have a feeling that's actually using texture tracking rather than wall tracking but that's something that we need to look at in a future tutorial um, but for now we're going to try and see if we can get the, the ceiling and the floor to working um, because I didn't realize that when I was making this video but I think the, the wall one doesn't work um, off the fly but you'll see that in, as I go through the video um, so there's also a list of new supported devices which is nice so hopefully your, your device is on here if you want to test it out um, and you know, you, here's a little preview as well of, of, of the power of, of AR Core. Um, now you know they're, they're putting it on a tree, different angles on the tree, which is pretty amazing. Um, all right, so you know AR Core is going to improve a hell of a lot this year. A hundred million users, I think that's what they're saying that it works on already. A hundred, so hundred million devices. So it's a really good time to be using. AR, uh, AR core and also they're gonna I think it looks like they're doing quite a bit with Google Lens so I'm gonna show you in this tutorial how to get the floor and the ceiling tracking working uh, the question mark in the heading about the walls is because obviously I don't get it working but I'm gonna look into that and if, if any of you have an idea of how, how to get that to work that would be amazing to hear so let me know and enough of that on to the tutorial All right, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the play settings, the build settings, I should say, uh, file, build settings, and I'm going to switch over to Android. And once that's done, uh, which is done really quickly, I'm going to go to assets and import pack, custom package. And I'm going to download the new AR Core Unity SDK version 1.0.0 uni <laughs> package uh, so let's get that in and let's see what we're working with I'm super excited actually to be doing this so uh, alright everything looks pretty normal computer vision that was the last one we had to look at I'm curious to see if we really can you know it, to um, place objects on floors and, and, and walls and ceilings all of those together would be absolutely incredible so I am really eager to do this in fact let me grab my cable as well alright so let's also change the settings in our player settings by going to the build settings and hitting player settings down here then we want to go and change if I remember correctly it some wasn't too difficult I think I'm gonna have to change this though so I've got my name here got AR call change this to seven was it highest is fine and then make sure AR call supported is on I think there was one other thing. Was it switch multi threading off? Maybe it was that. Let me have a quick look at the guide. Uh, multi threading off. Yes, that is it. All right. So once that's done, we can now go to our project settings, go into Google AR, or go to examples, go to Hello AR scenes. Let's just go straight for this one. I'm just going to run this because this is what I'm really interested in. Um, I wonder why I can actually. I wonder what I'm. Why is it blue screen? It's new, right? For those of you who are who've seen this before, usually is it always blue? I can't even remember now. Okay, so in the uh, editor, 
everything seems to be okay probably got a bunch of errors because a uh, call is not being initialized fine that's okay I'm just gonna delete this what I'm gonna do now is run it on the phone and let's take a look at what it looks like all right so you can see I'm, I'm tracking the ceiling here uh, which is really cool in this video um, and then I also go and I track you know the floor as you'd expect um, I try to track the wall, but I just can't seem to get it to work. So, which is why I'm assuming it's to do with the. Uh, it actually doesn't really do wall yet. Maybe unless there's a texture on the wall, a particular type of texture on the wall, um, because it seems like on the images they don't seem to have that uh, tracking plane image on, on any of the on, the, on any of the walls there. Anyway, I hope this helps. And I'll look into it. And if any of you have any advice, let me know. And see you next time.